Did you know that craving for food might actually be a sign of disease? Most people don't know that craving for sugar can mean diabetes. Craving for chocolate can be the result of a magnesium deficiency. And craving dirt or ice, the lack of iron in your blood. Believe me, all this is true and certain cravings can mean different things. Sometimes knowing their signs and symptoms could be life-saving, especially if you know how to recognize them before it's too late. So in today's video, I'm going to reveal what food cravings mean and what signs and symptoms indicate you might be sick before it's too late. Hey guys, Dr. Gus here, naturopath, acupuncturist, conventional doctor, and founder of DrLandNivar.com. In this channel, as a conventional doctor, treating patients through natural medicine before recurring to the use of pharmaceutical drugs. So if you're new to my channel, consider subscribing and press that bell down below to see notifications and be the first one to watch a new video. If you need a line of appointment quality supplements for your disease, visit DrLandNivar.com and stay till the end of this video. I'm going to share extra tips and video links related to this topic. Food cravings are very common. We all know that. We all know that they're difficult to ignore also and can typically appear when we least expect them to. But why do they happen and why do we have them? Why do they appear many times after we've already had a meal? You see, food cravings exist due to two very important factors. One, physical, and the other, mental. In many occasions, they can be a sign of an underlying condition that should not be ignored, and that's why the secret lies in identifying these characteristics and understanding when and why they are happening. So in today's video, I'm going to reveal what food cravings mean and what signs and symptoms indicate you might be sick before it's too late. Number one, your hormones are not well balanced. What are some of the most important substances involved in food consumption, digestion, and metabolism? They're your hormones. Why do you think pregnant women, for example, get so hungry during pregnancy? It's because their hormones are asking for more food. Thyroid hormones, for example, insulin, ghrelin, leptin, and others are all well involved in hunger and food cravings. Now, if your hormones are not well balanced, forget that peace of mind, you will not have it and you will have cravings all the time. Oh, and by the way, don't forget that not having your hormones in check is terribly unhealthy. So diabetes, reproduction, weight gain, gastritis, you name it, hormones have a direct correlation with every single one of these health conditions. So it's a very good idea that you keep them in check. And if you're having food cravings, I think it's a very good idea that you get your hormones checked before you see any health condition appear later in the long run. If you need two of the best supplement formulas involved in food and hormone regulation, look for Appalizer and Metathyroid from Finland at drlandivar.com. Number two, your body is asking for a vitamin or a mineral. Did you know that your body can actually ask you to eat certain things because it may be needing a specific vitamin and mineral in that certain food? Most people don't know that certain nutrient deficiencies are expressed by our brains with that desire to consume certain foods. For example, if you're craving cheese, your body might be needing healthy fats. If you're craving pastries, you might be needing chromium. If your body is asking for sugar, you might only be needing to consume certain foods that are high in sulfur or phosphorus. It's amazing how we can have that capability of asking, our body can ask for certain foods that many times contain the same specific vitamin and mineral we are needing. This is actually one of the reasons why it's always a great idea to consume a good quality multivitamin formula that can help you with every single nutrient deficiency you might have and food cravings. And don't confuse eating a lot with eating healthy. Most of the times, eating a lot does not exactly mean you are eating what you need. You're eating healthy. If you need a good quality multivitamin formula that contains all the vitamins and minerals you need on a daily basis with 42 different organic fruit and vegetable extracts on top of that, look for multivitamin from Finland at drlandivar.com. Number three, you need quality sleep. If you really want to know why you're craving to eat certain foods, you have to look at your sleep. 
And if you didn't know this, you should because your appetite is greatly affected by how the human body regulates its sleep and wake cycle. You see, sleep deprivation or not getting enough good quality sleep, which are two completely different things, disrupts hormonal fluctuations and actually produces food cravings. This change in hormone balance can lead to poor appetite regulation, which later during the day activates strong food cravings all throughout the body. If you don't believe me, let's look at what several studies are saying. Many studies show that sleep deprived individuals are up to a 55% more likely to become obese compared to people who get enough sleep. And this is obviously one of the most important reasons why getting enough quality sleep can become one of the most powerful ways to prevent food cravings from appearing. So in a nutshell, without sleep, everything goes haywire. If you need two of the best natural supplements for good quality sleep, I recommend you look for melatonin and 5-HTP from Finland at drlandivar.com. Number four, you're not eating right. How many of us have actually already gone on a diet and seen that food cravings and anxiety get a lot worse? You might not be eating properly and lacking, for example, protein. People that go on a diet don't know how to use protein and it's one of those hidden gems that most people really need when they do any type of changing in consumption of food. You see, when you eat healthy proteins, the digestive system takes more time to empty your stomach, giving you a longer period of time without food cravings. Eating more protein reduces appetite and keeps you from overeating, for example. It reduces cravings and it actually helps you feel full and satisfied for a longer period of time. For example, in one study which involved overweight patients and teenage girls, researchers discovered that eating a high protein breakfast reduces cravings significantly by 50%. Another study in overweight men showed that increasing protein intake by 25% of calories reduces a craving by 60%, which is a lot. Some of the best proteins you can consume include, for example, egg whites, fatty fish, poultry, all of these are excellent. I use this technique a lot at home and barely have any food cravings between meals and actually I observe the other factors I've just mentioned in this video. I try to keep my meals at the same time every day with a great effort to educate my body and having it feel very, very good in the process. If you need something healthy to go on a diet that can help you actually lose weight and take away food cravings, look for figure riser and meta glucose from Finland at drlandivar.com. And help out the channel by giving this a thumbs up and sharing with your friends and family. If you have any questions, leave your comments down below and I'll be happy to assist you. If you need quality supplements for your disease or align an appointment, visit drlandivar.com. And check out these other videos related to stopping and valuable information that might prevent a serious health condition in the future. Thanks for watching you guys and I'll see you soon.